Hello, welcome to Kent Beer Reviews. Right, I've got another beer from Ager Acti Brewery, and this is their Little Bro Session IPA. Lovely looking can. They seem to be most of what I've had so far looking very similar, but yeah, brilliant artwork. Um, this is coming in at 4.7% ABV um, out of Norway. Uh, where does it say? Flam. I'm probably butchering that. Norway. So yeah, another Norwegian beer. And um, this is my, I mean, this is my third beer from this brewery. So I purchased this at Tall Boys in Leeds when I was up there in September. It's got them 360 open top cans, which are really quite cool. You can see how much beer you leave behind under the lip. Right, I don't know what hops are in this again. I don't think it elaborates on the can, although there's a fair bit of information in English in this on this one. Let's pour it all in. So it's a lovely orangey colour, like the last review from this brewery. Obviously unfiltered for the look. Yeah, loads of little suspended particles in the beer. It's a, it's not very much. A quarter of a, yeah, white head. Some bigger bubbles on top. It's getting aroma. Oh, it's got a lovely kind of malt build to this beer, a real kind of, it smells quite juicy, um, a very kind of, yeah, fresh aroma of tropical fruit notes, pineapple, a lovely kind of, that, you know that breadiness you get on some of these beers, it smells beautiful pineapple obviously big kind of citrus uh mango i've already said real juicy one right let's go for it cheers oh that's nice that's a nice beer slight bittering there's a slight dryness i don't know what hops as i've said possibly um, I'm leaning towards Australian and possibly New Zealand hops. There's a slight prickly edge about the third of the way through of the taste. Not picking up the ABV. This is this is nice. I must admit. Mm. Nice pine edge. There's a pininess coming through. Maybe it's some hops from, well, almost certainly hops from America and Australia, New Zealand as well. Possibly. No idea. It's slightly, yeah, that, that pine, push, uh, crushed pine needles on the aroma. And definitely on the, on the taste. There's a slight kind of wood bark edge. Oh. That is awesome. Make sure I've got everything out of here. There is a bit of a write up. Let me see if I can put the right way around so you can read it. If you want to pause it, go for it. There's not a lot of things to add from that writing, but they have got a website, I believe. Um, I will put it down below if I can find it. So yeah, another beer from Norway. This is really quite pleasant. For me, as for a rating. Yeah, that's a that's an 8 out of 10 all day long. It's about between 90 to 92 out of 100 in the 100 scale. Really nice beer. Mm. Do like that. You could drink quite a few of these cans. Plus, you know, in these style cans they're fantastic yeah best before the 13th of july 2017 so it's a little bit i'm just reviewing it the same day as i just drunk that so this is a little bit fresher than this and it's definitely coming through this is probably a slightly older can um with a best buy the 15th so yeah check out this brewery that's the one we're doing the review on. But yeah, check out the review on this. 
I'm not sure when I'm going to post these. It won't be one after the other. So I'll put a playlist together of this brewery. Yeah, check it out. 8 out of 10. Um, fantastic stuff. Let us know you've had it before. And I'll see you on the next review. Cheers.